Hello good people. How are you all doing today? I hope you are doing good from wherever you are watching this video from. I am also doing great. My name is Masi and I welcome all of you to our YouTube channel. If you are new here kindly consider subscribing to our channel and also turn on the notification bell so that every time I upload a new video you will be among the first to get notified and for our returning subscribers thank you so much thank you so much my people for always being here thank you for that support that you always give to me i appreciate all of you and i must say you are all amazing so my people you know our main thing here is to just give the special support to harry and megan because you know these people deserve the best and they are always getting the attacks, you know, and my people, I have always been saying so. Now, for today, I just want us to focus on some other things whereby we have Camilla. Now, that is basically the queen that we have. And my people, you know, from our previous stories, we have been talking of the kind of wave that actually came in the royal family and you know what happened everything the way they are actually going right now we have the health crisis season in the royal family and everything is not set it's not even well done anyway as much as we are talking of the health being an interruption we also know the kind of people in the throne and by that i mean charles and even William and Kate. So you know, they are not people whom we can actually rely on. But now there is this thing about health issues that actually came in and added some salt on the wound. So my people, you know, just after the news we got about Kate, and then again we got the news about Charles' health, you know, we were so worried and I remember I was talking of this story in my previous one. I do not know if you people got a chance to see that. Whereby we were told that the monarchy needs to be run by some other people. And then there were some people who were actually mentioned. I remember I was talking of Princess Beatrice and my people. You remember that time? where they even listed some members of the royal family who are going to take over this, especially during this period. But now, all I saw in that story, you know, they were actually talking of Camilla being the head of this group. And my people, I remember I told you that if Camilla is someone who can, who can actually be dependent on, and then everything will be working in the opposite direction. And you know, as much as we are talking of Camilla being a failed one, she will not do anything of that. I'm not saying that Charles is someone who can even do any better. It's only that I felt like Camilla will take things even to the worst direction ever. And you know, I just got something, you know, I just found out that Camilla is already given the responsibilities definitely by default she had to step in for charles right now as charles is actually struggling with other things because my people you know we were even told charles himself was not able to show up at the church service and my people you know that is basically because of the health issues but now what is giving me the concern is that camilla Stepping out of the royal family, you know, just going for the royal engagement. And we are told that she just went to visit the domestic abuse support that is in Sweden. And my, just as I have told you, Camilla by default had to come in to support Charles. So my people, I just found this news about Camilla stepping out and actually going for the royal engagements. And you know, we are told that the queen has stepped out for a royal engagement today as the king is set to 
is set for surgery this week. So Camilla traveled to Sweden today to visit the domestic abuse support service. My people, you know, it's okay. Just as I have said, by default, she had to come in for Charles. And it's okay. She already came in. She is now involved in the royal engagements. But what gave me some concern is even the domestic abuse support service. So that's where Camilla went to show some support or something. And you know, I was just thinking of whatever have happened in the royal family. Even all along, you remember even during the time of Princess Diana, everything that happened, my people, I cannot even say Camilla is someone who is fit to go support people who are fighting against domestic abuse. Because my people, you know, I tend to associate Camilla with domestic abuse. You know, whatever Princess Diana went through, my people, I can tell you. I will just proudly say that Camilla is part of those people who treated Princess Diana in that manner. And that's why I'm saying that whenever she goes out for such things, domestic abuse support, honestly. This is also another hypocrisy from the royal family. My people, you know, so actually these people were celebrating their 50th anniversary and you know, it's a good charity refuge. But my people, I'm just concerned. I'm just worried of who is visiting there. You can imagine Camilla herself. She's not fit. My people, I'm not lying. I'm just saying from whatever has happened. Every other time we have heard a lot of things from Camilla, you know. But you know, this queen actually is someone who is somehow putting things under waters, you know. But we cannot fail to know that this person is such a bad person. Because things will definitely get out. As much as we are talking of Princess Diana got an accident, you know. I always have some other view on that. And my people maybe, I will not get deep into it today. But I just want you to be aware that Camilla is part of those people who are actually supporting domestic abuse. I'll just say that. And I am not even sorry for saying so. So basically, this stepping out to support that particular agency whereby they are fighting against domestic abuse. I just found out that it's a good initiative, but for Camilla, she's just going there for the PR and so that we may see she's already stepping up to even take up the responsibilities for Charles. So basically, my people, that is what we have. I want you to comment down below concerning the same, same story. And up to this particular point, allow me to end it here. Thank you so much for watching up to the end. My people, stay safe and also stay tuned for our next one. Goodbye.